I'm here with uh, one of my favorite people, uh, some, <laughs> someone who's a friend of the website. Um, why don't you tell the good folks who you are? Um, so why did you forget my name? Um, I'm, uh, I'm Courtney Baldy. I'm the pastry chef here at Revolution. Uh, we are here uh, live at Revolution Brewery. How long have you been here? I've been here since a couple weeks before we opened, so almost three years now. I wanted to sit down with you today because uh, the Brew Pub Shootout is mm -hmm. coming up. And for those who don't know, uh, Chicago Beer Society, the oldest uh, beer appreciation group in the city, uh, has a series of annual events. One of them is the Brew Pub Shootout. It's brew pubs, and then uh, they do allow just breweries that don't have pubs to enter, and then they they can just bring whoever they want to make their food. Sometimes, you know, one time I think Half Acre, one of their dudes, his girlfriend was the person making the food uh, last year. Bill Kim made food for someone, so it's kind of whoever you can con into making your food for you. But, you know, the brew pubs, obviously, we have a built-in kitchen, and you just have your own staff do it. And you've won this event two years in a row with, I have. with pastry dishes. I have. So the first year, what we did was the beer was the Triple Fist, which is a triple version of our Iron Fist Pale Ale, okay. so I guess double IPA. And I, uh, I paired it with Citra Hop Ice Cream, which that was one of those things where I said I wanted to make it and everybody kind of looked at me like I was a crazy person. And they kind of just dismissed me and then I went off and I made it anyway and people loved it. So yeah, we did that and uh, it was paired with raspberries and mango and all sorts of delicious flavors that kind of pair with the, uh, the Citra Hops that were in that beer. So uh, yeah, that was the first year. Uh -huh. And then the second year we did the uh, barrel aged black power oatmeal stout with cherries. Oh, wow. And I paired that with, uh, I made little ice cream pops with uh, cherry vanilla ice cream and it was coated in a, a malt chocolate and some uh, candied almonds. All right, let's try some of this let's ice cream. some ice cream. <laughs> How about that? Right? Um, nice balance of uh, chocolate, cream. Um, that, that's lovely. So yeah, you get some chocolate flavors, you get some coffee flavors. It's all coming straight from the beer. And uh, you know, we also have some Eugene here if you wanna compare the yeah, ice cream with absolutely. the beer. Now is this is this something that you can get on the on the menu? It's on our menu, yeah. Okay. It comes with chocolate cake, because why not? It's, it's probably the most decadent thing on the dessert menu on purpose, because I like it that way. Yeah, and the porter, I think, you know, is, is, uh, is really cool with the ice cream because in comparison to the stout, you know, the mouth feel isn't big and, mm -hmm. and heavy, and then it's got a dry finish. Mm -hmm. It doesn't linger, it gives you a chance. It's got a nice harmony with the ice cream, which, which, which I really like. Um, yeah, that's good stuff. Um, yeah, actually, I caught off guard by the flavors here, dude. <laughs> so, uh, I, was, I was just kind of like, yeah. I was picturing myself in a really big bowl of this ice cream, and I'm like, fuck, what's the next question? <laughs> oh, that's the best thing I've ever heard. Oh, man.